9 Early Warning Signs of Kidney Problems The kidneys are vital for maintaining overall health, and any harm to them can result in significant health complications. It's crucial to identify warning signs early to prevent additional damage. In this video, we'll explore 9 early signs of kidney problems that you mustn't overlook. 1. Changes in urination frequency, volume, or color. The kidneys are integral to the urinary system, responsible for filtering waste products and excess fluids from the blood to generate urine. Alterations in urination can serve as an early indicator of kidney issues. One prevalent change associated with kidney problems is reduced urine output, termed oliguria, where the volume of urine produced decreases. Some individuals with kidney disease may even encounter anuria, the absence of urine production. Additionally, having dark and concentrated urine might signify ineffective waste filtration by the kidneys, leading to waste accumulation and urine concentration. This condition can arise due to factors like dehydration, specific medications, or kidney disease. Furthermore, changes in urine appearance could signify underlying problems. For instance, the presence of blood in urine, known as hematuria, may indicate kidney damage, infections, or kidney stones. Proteinuria, the presence of protein in urine, may also signal kidney damage or conditions such as diabetes or hypertension. Various factors like urinary tract infections or prostate issues can also prompt changes in urination. However, if alterations in urination persist or are accompanied by other symptoms, it's advisable to consult a healthcare provider to determine the underlying cause and receive appropriate treatment. 2. Fatigue or Weakness Fatigue is a prevalent indication of kidney issues, particularly among individuals with chronic kidney disease CKD. When the kidneys fail to function adequately, waste and toxins can accumulate in the blood, resulting in sensations of tiredness and weakness. This fatigue can stem from fluctuations in hormone levels, imbalances in minerals, and the buildup of metabolic waste. Research indicates that individuals with CKD report higher levels of fatigue compared to the general population, and the severity of fatigue correlates with the progression of kidney disease, with those in advanced stages experiencing more pronounced fatigue. Additionally, Patients with kidney disease may also experience mental fatigue or difficulty concentrating, attributed to alterations in brain function caused by the accumulation of toxins and waste in the bloodstream. It's noteworthy that fatigue can also manifest as a symptom of other medical conditions such as anemia or thyroid disorders. 3. Swelling in the hands, feet, or ankles. Kidney disease symptoms often encompass swelling, medically termed edema. When the kidneys falter, they may struggle to eliminate surplus fluid from the body, resulting in swelling in various regions like the hands, feet, ankles, and face. Additionally, individuals may notice weight gain, particularly if the swelling is pronounced, owing to the buildup of excess fluid. It's worth noting that edema can also signal other medical issues like heart failure or liver disease. Hence, it's advisable to seek medical attention if you encounter significant swelling alongside additional symptoms such as shortness of breath, chest pain, or abdominal discomfort. 4. Shortness of breath. Experiencing shortness of breath, medically referred to as dyspnea, is a symptom associated with various medical conditions, including kidney problems. The kidneys play a vital role in regulating fluid balance within the body. When they operate optimally, surplus fluids and waste are effectively filtered from the blood and expelled through urine. However, if the kidneys sustain damage or disease, they may struggle to perform this essential function. Consequently, fluid may accumulate in various body regions, including the lungs, leading to symptoms such as shortness of breath, coughing, and potentially chest pain. In the later stages of kidney disease, this accumulation can escalate to pulmonary edema, characterized by a dangerous buildup of fluid in the lungs, necessitating prompt medical intervention. 5. High blood pressure. Elevated blood pressure, or hypertension, can serve as an indicator of kidney issues. The kidneys play a pivotal role in blood pressure regulation by managing fluid levels in the body and adjusting the diameter of blood vessels. 
In individuals with good health, the kidneys produce hormones that aid in blood pressure regulation. When blood pressure decreases, the kidneys release renin, initiating a series of reactions that elevate blood pressure. Conversely, if blood pressure is excessively high, the kidneys release atrial natriuretic peptide ANP, hormone, which helps lower blood pressure by promoting the excretion of sodium and water. However, in individuals with kidney disease, these regulatory functions may be compromised, resulting in fluid and electrolyte imbalances and an elevation in blood pressure. This situation can initiate a harmful cycle, as heightened blood pressure can further harm the kidneys, leading to a deterioration in kidney function and exacerbating hypertension. 6. Nausea and Vomiting Loss of appetite, nausea, and vomiting are prevalent symptoms of kidney disease, particularly in its advanced phases. When the kidneys fail to function properly, waste products and toxins may accumulate in the bloodstream, resulting in a condition known as uremia. Uremia can manifest in various symptoms, including nausea and vomiting. Additionally, the kidneys play a pivotal role in maintaining electrolyte balance within the body, including sodium, potassium, and calcium. Dysfunction in kidney function can precipitate electrolyte imbalances, contributing to symptoms such as nausea and vomiting. Furthermore, certain medications used by individuals with kidney disease, such as antibiotics, painkillers, and chemotherapy drugs, can induce gastrointestinal side effects like nausea and vomiting. Moreover, loss of appetite can be attributed to elevated levels of waste products in the body and reduced production of hormones responsible for regulating appetite. 7. Itching and Dry Skin Patients with end-stage renal disease ESRD, undergoing dialysis frequently contend with itching and dry skin. Research indicates that as many as 50% of ESRD patients endure moderate to severe itching. While the precise cause of itching in kidney disease remains unclear, it is theorized to stem from the proliferation of uremic toxins in the bloodstream. These toxins have the potential to trigger skin inflammation and irritation, culminating in sensations of itchiness and dryness. Additionally, factors like fluctuations in calcium and phosphorus levels, dehydration, and specific medications can contribute to the onset of itching. 8. Muscle Cramps Kidney patients, particularly those undergoing dialysis, often experience muscle cramps. These cramps may arise from electrolyte imbalances resulting from impaired kidney function. Electrolytes such as calcium, magnesium, and potassium are indispensable for the appropriate functioning of muscles. When these electrolyte levels deviate significantly, either too high or too low, it can trigger muscle cramps. In individuals with kidney disease, especially those on dialysis, substantial electrolyte loss can occur, predisposing them to muscle cramps, particularly in the extremities like legs, feet, and hands. Furthermore, muscle cramps may also stem from the accumulation of waste in the bloodstream, leading to muscle fatigue and cramping. Additionally, inadequate levels of calcium or magnesium in the bloodstream can provoke muscle cramps. Calcium is crucial for muscle function, and insufficient levels can result in muscle cramps and weakness. Similarly, magnesium is vital for optimal muscle function, and deficiencies can lead to muscle cramps, tremors, and spasms. 9. Back Pain Back pain, particularly when localized in the lower back or sides, often signals kidney issues. Positioned in the lower back region just below the ribcage, the kidneys function to filter waste and surplus fluids from the bloodstream. In cases of kidney disease, back pain can also stem from a kidney infection called pyelonephritis. Pyelonephritis occurs when bacteria infiltrate the urinary tract and migrate to the kidneys, instigating inflammation and swelling, resulting in discomfort in the lower back or sides along with accompanying symptoms like fever, chills, and fatigue. Additionally, kidney stones represent another potential cause of back pain in kidney disease. These solid mineral deposits can develop within the kidneys or urinary tract, and when they traverse the urinary tract, they may induce intense pain in the lower back, sides, and groin, alongside symptoms such as nausea, vomiting, and painful urination. Furthermore, conditions like polycystic kidney disease, 
PKD, can lead to kidney enlargement, culminating in back pain and discomfort. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.